Idealists! In this video, I'm going to be explaining how the rhythm goes in the second level of the A major scale for my orchestra karate challenge. This is a challenging rhythm. That is why it is the last one on the page. Um, and the reason that this one is challenging is it has a mixture of eighth notes, quarter notes, dotted quarter notes, half notes, and 16th notes. Um, so it is definitely some challenge. So just to review some of these rhythms, eighth notes, two of them fit in a beat, T, 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 okay? Um, we can also count our rhythms using numbers, and that's going to really help us in this song. If you look at it, you're going to notice that there are four beats in each measure. And if we keep track of what beat the notes are on, that's going to help us fit in, okay? So we have eighth notes, T, 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 T. We have quarter notes, Ta, Ta, Ta. We have sixteenth notes, Ticka, 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 Ticka. We have half notes, Ta. And then we have some uh, dotted quarter notes, um, ta ti, and that is a quarter, dotted quarter note. So if I, we look through this rhythm right here, keep a steady beat, I'm going to count it, and I'm going to play it, okay, I'm going to count it a couple different ways. First I'm going to count it with, um, ta's and tt's and those syllables for the words, okay? One, two, ready. Ta ta ti ti ta ti ti ta ta ti 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 ta ta ticka ticka ta. Go ahead and do that again a couple times with me. Now I'm going to count it using number syllables. So I'm going to be counting the beats that the notes are on. So for example, in the first measure, on beat one, we have a pair of eighth notes. One and. On beat two, we have a quarter note. Two. It's a whole note. It's a whole beat. On beat three, we have a dotted quarter note. Three and four. It takes a beat and a half. And then we have an eighth note. And. Just follow along with me. Keep a steady beat. One, two. One and two, three and four, and one, two, three and four. One and two and three and four. One, two, we end a three, four. And you'll notice on those longer notes that I was sort of count, I was counting the the beats that went through, um, kind of, but just kind of like smoothing it out. Okay, so now, listen. Now, our A major scale, if you haven't watched my explanation of how to play a regular A major scale, you need to do that, because that is going to explain the notes for this. Um, on the board behind me, I have the A major scale with the, the straight rhythm, not with the level two rhythm. This is just level one. Um, so just to remind you, it has a high third fingers for our C sharp on the G string and for our G sharp on the D string right there. So I'm finding my first finger, A, one, two, three, four. 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 I stopped counting partway through that. I'm going to do that one more time. I'm just going to be counting on the beats as they fall. Okay, so I'll be counting one, two, three, four, and the notes will go through those. First finger right. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. is 
is the level two for A major. And so if you make yourself all the way to that level two, you got your second degree black belt. Congratulations.